it's something special to do this. I mean, to do this. Everybody can't become, everybody can't be a foster parent. It has changed our life totally. <laughs> we have no schedule as far as sleeping or anything like that. You're busy 24 seven. I've been a foster parent for about 13, 13 years. I was expecting really, really unruly kids uh, and never to be changed. But um, no, it's not the case. When you come in, of course, you have these kids that are unpolished, literally, but they're diamonds that need to be polished so they could shine. That's what I do, I take care of children. And I try to direct them, give them structure, keep them in school, give them inspiration to become something. He's soft with the kids. I'm the one that has to put the rules, so. I usually don't take babies, I take tough teenagers, pretty much. I take the teenagers. It has been wonderful, and, 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 um, and the backup that I got, that I get from uh, the case workers and the, and the supervisors are there for me all the time, not a problem. We work together. We work together, they're always there for me. Somebody always here in every department to help you, so I think the, the staff is very, very supportive. There's no money that could give you the reward that this is doing for me, or for us. It's, I, got a lot of, I got a lot of good out of it. I got a lot of good. Show me the different opportunities you have of being a father. It's a blessing. I ain't never been in a program that, you know, help you be a better father. You know, I'm, I'm a new father. They feeling confused on life from being a dad. I'd rather, instead of being out and not knowing anything, they could get the help from this program because it has opportunities on teaching them on how to be a great dad if they want to be in their children's life. I want my son to be to know I've been there, know I was there, know I'm still there, and know, I, know that I'll always be there. The chances you have of being, a, well, to be a great dad, the actual guidelines I learned from here, and I'm actually following them and it's doing good in my life. It was a shock to me, because I didn't feel like I was ready to be a mom. I didn't feel like I was going to be a good mom. I wasn't like really listening. I wasn't going to drug treatment. I wasn't doing anything. Coming to Forest Bells changed that completely. It actually teach you how to do, how to have more affection with your child. And that's good for people that didn't grow up in a household full of affection and love. I was like in and out of foster home, so I want to break that cycle. So Forest Dolls actually helped me with a lot. They helped me to say, you can focus on you and focus on your daughter, and we're going to help you with that. But it's up to you if you want to receive the help or not. I know what I have to do because I have kids now. So, you know, I can't just think about me. I have to think about them too. If I never came here, I would have never done half of the things I've done now. I could go to school and, you know, get my GED and then, you know, go to college. <laughs> I just want to really show my daughter, you know, you can do it regardless of what's going on in your life. You can do it because mommy did it. I'm 13 and these are my siblings. This is like my home because I came into here when I was little. Before, I was really scared about coming here. But now I feel confident, you know, to come here, you know, and hang out with my peers and be with the staff that's really motivating me to get to the point I want to be in my life. I think that people will love coming to Forest Hill because they, they teach you how to do things. Play outside, bas basketball and football with other foster kids. You have so many people that went through the same thing as you and you have people you could trust. Some of the kids, they have similar like stories that I went through. Sometimes, you know, I share my story with them, and then they share their story with me, and then we can help, like, uh, like you know, be close to one another. As far as still, you get to meet new people first, and you get to learn about yourself. My mom is doing better. What happens to me that happened to me in the past, I can still grow up and to become whatever I want to be. Life isn't about finding yourself, it's about creating yourself, which fire cell helps you with. I want to become a forensic pathologist. Child psychologist. Football or a basketball player. My dream college is Harvard. It's going to be hard, but um, I'm willing to do it.